Question 6. Prove from first principles that the derivative of 3x squared is 6x. Now this is a standard procedure we're going to work through. We begin by saying let fx equal 3x squared. Then f dash of x, the derivative of fx, is defined to be the limit as h tends to 0 of f of x plus h minus f of x all divided by h. And the next line, it's the limit as h tends to 0. Now f of x plus h, we were putting x plus h in instead of x in the function. So we've got 3 x plus h squared. And then we subtract in f of x, which is just 3x squared, all divided by h. And we keep writing, limit h tends to 0 right up until the last line. Now, we have to expand x plus h squared. If this was a higher power that we were differentiating, you would use Pascal's triangle from the binomial expansion to help you do this. But when, with it just being squared, it's nice and straightforward. So it's 3x squared plus twice the product 2xh plus the h squared minus 3x squared, all divided by h. So that's the limit as h tends to 0 of 3x squared plus 6xh plus 3h squared minus 3x squared all over h. And we see here that the 3x squareds cancel. So we've got the limit as h tends to 0 of 6xh plus 3h squared all divided by h. Now 6xh divided by h is 6x and plus 3h squared divided by h is plus 3h. Now only now am I going to stop writing the limit as h tends to 0. I'm going to let it become 0, in which case the 6x will still be 6x, but the 3h will be 3 times 0. So that means that f dash of x, the derivative, is 6x as required.